Right, man. Guess what, man? Like I said, we had Black Wall Street, man. We had our own everything. Own banks. Own uh, hospital. Whatever you name, man. Funeral home, grocery store. We had all that. We had Black Wall Street. That was just like the epitome of it, man. But every city had something like Black Wall Street going on, man. But guess what, man? These curses kicked in, man. Lord had to show us this one our rest, man. So we didn't, we didn't had it, we didn't had situations, man. After they let us out the chains, man. Because when they let us out the chains, man, we was the one who had to do everything. So Kyle White, man, he, he was just whooping, he was just watching, man. We, we was the event, we inventors of everything, man. So they let the chains off, shit. We started doing that. We, we were coming up, man. We got, we were multiplying. We used the workers, man. So we started establishing, man. We started establishing our own businesses and everything, man. You know? But guess what? Lord oh, still had to show us your punishment ain't up. This ain't your rest, man. You're still under the so-called rulership of the so-called white man. He had to show us he gonna redeem us, man. Can't redeem ourselves, man. He gonna come redeem us. He gonna get the glory, man. Why? Because he the one shed his blood, man. He made that decision to die for the nation, man. You know? Curse should be, be not basket and not store. And this as a whole, man. Curse should be the fruit of thy body and the fruit of thy land. The increase of thy kind and the flocks of thy sheep, man. And see, that's another... That, that's part of, I think, that if I'm not mistaken, man, but that's the reason, too, why part of the lynching started, man. We was prosper, I business was probably was prospering more than them, man. But the so-called white man started lynching, lynching, I, lynching, them, lynching them people, like, showing them, this is what's going to happen to you. You think you're going to, you think you're going to, oh, now you think you're finna ball, you finna, you finna, oh, um, prosper more than us? In, in, in our kingdom? No. But the but. Ultimately, it was the Lord, man, because he, he used them. The wicked is his sword, man. Cursed shall thou be when thou comest in, and cursed shall thou be when thou goest out, man. What's that, man? Everybody look at us, man, like, look at them, man. Look at them so-called niggas, man. Look at them wetbacks and speaks, you know? Look at the Native American Indians, man. All they do is sit on their reservation, get drunk and shit, right? You know? Look at them, man. So we curse, curse should I be going in and curse should I be going out, man. Nobody want to deal with us, man, but this the curse the Lord put up on us, man. And he the only one can take it off, man. But this one, this, this, and I'm reading this for our people to understand, man. You have to understand what's going on, man. You don't got no understanding of what's going on, man. You lost, man. You seeking to understand what now you getting it, man. But only one third gonna get it, man. The Lord shall send upon thee cursing, vexation, and rebuke. And all that thou saidest thine hand unto, unto for to do, till thou be destroyed, and till thou perish quickly, because of the wickedness of thy doings, whereby thou hast forsaken me. So this is what happened to all the black businesses, man. So-called black, Hispanic, Latino, and Native American businesses, man. You know? Like I said, this is why people else are whole, man. You know? So this is why Black Wall Street got destroyed, man. You know? We had a, we had a, a small version of Black Wall Street, the street over, man, on Ferris Street, man. In Jackson, Mississippi, man. You know? Guess who's trying to revive it right now, man? The so-called white man, man. To make money out of it, man. You know? But it say, Lord, she's sitting upon thee cursing and vexation 
and rebuke. And all that thou said is thy hand to do, or to, to do, man. Right, man. So that's why I see, like, as a whole, man, you got some, you got some individuals as a whole. This as a whole. Then you got individualized people, you, you, you know. You might see this video, man. And you like, man. That's why I can't get right, man. That's why no matter what I do, yeah, man. Yeah, that's why, man. You want to put the curse upon us, man. But guess what, man? You come back to your heritage, man. And you learn this truth. Then you realize this ain't your rest. You learn why you're going through this. Then you understand that, man. And then you deal with the situation better, man. You're going to be going out putting your life on the land just for, just, just for the, some money, man. Then you start to understand that. In order to try to buy, but he lost that command to the best of your ability. Lord, I already said, seek him in the kingdom first. He gonna give you everything you need, man. Once you learn this truth, you'll realize all the stuff you're striving for ain't even nothing, man. It's what we striving for the kingdom, man. The everlasting joy, happiness, the real riches, man. Where there will be no more tears and pain, man. All that people are gonna be righteous, man. Ain't gonna be no beef with nobody, man. Whatever happiness for the people on the sand, man. But right now we gotta continue to live out these curses, man. Until the Lord say time is up. The Lord shall make the pestilence cleave unto thee until, until he have consumed thee from off the land, whether thou goest to possess it, man. What happened, man? Uh, Psalm 106, man. Lord, bring us into captivity on the people. He has raised up a judge to deliver us, man. And he kept doing that and doing that, man. Let us go back to our own land to you. Like, look. I'm going to destroy them. I'm going to destroy them, man. I'm going to destroy them to the point to where it's going to look like ain't no more hope for them, man. They're going to forget who they are. They're going to just discontinue from their heritage and all that, man. And this is what happened, man. And that's why I'm reading all this. I just lead up to something else, man, that I'm going to go into, man. All this has to be read out according to the scriptures, man. How else you going to understand? How else you going to know, man? This is the history. This is the arm. Um, this is the history of our people, man. This is the history book of these so-called Negroes, Hispanics, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. No people wrote this book, man. No ancestors, man. Your forefathers, man. They wrote this. Move by the spirit or you have by sure you have a shot, man. And yeah, they got history of your other nations in here too, man. But this is this is my this is our book to show us, bring understanding to us, man. The Lord, what it say, in, in the pestilence should plead me to thee, man. That's why it's like we the number one. They I mean every disease, man, as far as these people, man, they mainly Judah, man. Because Judah is the head trap. Look at high blood pressure, diabetes, but guess what? The so-called white man created a system to wear you aware this is. But like I said, he is the Lord's form, man. And the Lord used him to do this, man. Like I said, he created a system to wear you a hair, diabetes, high blood pressure. Uh, he put all the BS food in, in, in your neighborhoods, man. Especially here, man, where I live, man. Jackson, Mississippi, man, they, hey, in Jake neighborhoods, man, the grocery store straight, man, straight GMO, man. That's all it is, man. That's all it's full of, man. They got two big GMO forms. Probably 30 minutes going, going, um, going east. 30, 30 minutes going, um, going west this way, man. Monsanto Farms, man. Florence, Mississippi, Brandon, Mississippi. They said, you know, he saw get caught up in it too, man. But like I said, man, the grocery stores, man, they put in the Jake neighborhood. It was by design, man. But like I said, 
Lord, you so-called white man. That's his sword, man. To pay us back for, for, for the, 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 the wickedness, man. What I'm going into, man. We ain't harking unto him, man. Got proud. He had us in rulership in the land of Israel under David and Solomon, man. And, and kings after them. He got proud. Didn't listen. So he had to bring the curse down, man. Verse 22. The Lord shall smite thee with, with a consumption and with fever and with an inflammation and with an extreme burning and with the sword and with blasting and with mildew if they should pursue thee until thou perish, man. So that's what you see going on, man. That's why people lead in all these, these different diseases, man. It's the curse the Lord put up on us, man. And thy heaven that is over thy head shall be brass. Because you don't think we were praying to the Lord, man, and he brought us into captivity. And we still here. We still pray to the Lord, man, and we still under these curses. Going to thy heaven is brass. The Lord will hear our prayers, man. Why? Because it's time for us to live out our punishment, man. Like I said. It was also prophesied that we was gonna remember our sins. So, you know, yeah, this while this got to be read, man. So making you remember yourself, man. Making you understand, man. Because we lost our memory, man. Due to the so-called white man beating it out of you, man. Kept bumping, knocking your head up against that wall until you forgot, man. And he underestimated the spirit of your house by shooting the house shot, man. Understand the Lord was controlling him, man. Now he fully understand it, man. As I'm reading out our judgment right now, man. You no, know, but the so-called white man got a greater judgment than us, man. He got a greater judgment than us. And thy heaven that is above over thy head shall be grass, and the earth that is under thee shall be iron. Well, we stuck right here and you gotta go gotta gotta um gotta gotta gotta, gotta, gotta live out our punishment man you no know? verse 24 the Lord shall make the rain of thy land powder and dust from heaven shall it come down upon thee until thou be destroyed man because what do the rain represent man in order for you be prosperous in, 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 in your vegetation and your property, you've had the rain, man. The Lord said, gonna make your rain dust, man, going until you prosper, man. He said, The Lord should cause thee to be smited before thine enemies. Thou should go out one way against them and flee seven ways before them. It should be removed into all the kingdoms of the earth. Who, who was removed into all the kingdoms of the earth, man? Nobody, nobody on the planet Earth but these people on this side, man. We was removed into all the kingdoms of the earth, man. No matter where you go, on the four corners of the earth, you're gonna see these people somewhere in their land, man. And these same curses gonna be upon them, man. Said the Lord oh, on this verse 
26. And thy carcass shall be meat unto all the fowls of the earth and unto the beasts of the earth. And no man shall fray. No man shall fray them away. The Lord will smite thee with the botch of Egypt and with the emrods and with the scab and with the itch world thou cannot be healed. Going to all these diseases, man. And the Lord shall smite thee with madness and blindness and astonishment of heart, man. So this is why you see a lot of our people bugged out of their minds, man. It's part of the curse the Lord put up on them, man. And thou shall grope at noonday. That's the blind groping in darkness, man. Because at noonday, that's when the sun in the top of the sky, man. But it say you're going to grope. That's a blind man in darkness, man. At noonday. Thou shalt not prosper in thy ways, and thou shalt be only oppressed and spoiled evermore, and no man shall save thee, man. Right. No man going to save thee. He said he shall be oppressed and spoiled. And no man going to save thee, man. Right. Had so-called leaders rise up, thought they was going to help and save you, man. You know, starting with your leaders. Uh, doing the civil rights movement until now, man. Which Barack Obama ain't our people, but he came president. Our people thought it was on. Or we should be on. No man going to save you, man. Which Barack Obama, he a hamite anyway, man. He set up there to deceive you, man. Thou shall betroth a wife, and another man shall lie with her, man. He's heavy right here, man. Thou shall build a house, and thou shall not dwell therein, man. Didn't it happen to the northern kingdom, man? Y'all had, had civilizations established, man. So-called Hispanic, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. The white man got over here, man. Y'all had, had North, South, and Central America, man. Y'all had it on. Y'all had it flushed out, man. You know? Well, he came and destroyed that, man. Took the so-called Native American Indians on reservations, man. Took all y'all land, man. Man, took millions and millions of acres, man. Probably, I think, hundreds of millions of acres. Thou should plant a vineyard, it should not gather the grapes thereof, man. Light, man. Northern Kingdom again, man. And when y'all got over here, man, when the white man got over here, man. Y'all had all types of vineyards and everything. Why don't you get on the beach and look at those stars? He took all that, man. He got so called white man. We came over here, he didn't know how to grow no car, he didn't know how to do it destroy. He taught him how to grow crops and survive, man. But just so you know the kingdom, because you know, y'all probably like, y'all ain't go on ships, and y'all, y'all, even though y'all was the first slaves going on ships back to Portugal and Spain, man, it wasn't in a book like the, like the, um, like Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, man. So y'all, you know, y'all like to think, okay, well, it ain't talking about this, man. Now it's getting that, now we're going to see, we're going to see, man. Ox shall be slain before thy ass, and thou shalt not eat thereof, man. What's a good example of that, man? Because this happened during the time of uh, Roman 7 AD 2, man. But guess what? This now, too, man, when the so called white man came over here, said that ox shall be slain before thy ass, man. What is it, North Dakota, man? So called because it was the Native Americans up there, man, Native American Indians. It was tribe could be gay, man. It could be the North, uh, North American Indian. But anyway, um, yeah, you had the buffalo, man. Which y'all use the buffalo for food, clothing, and shelter, man. The so called white man peeped that out and understood that, man. That's why he started to kill the buffalo out, man. You know? 
that an ox should be slain before their ass, and thou should not eat thereof. Which this going into two, I just use that for an example. We'll keep reading. If thou should not eat thereof, that ass should be taken away, should be violently taken away from thee before thy ass. to the white man taking whatever you whatever you had, man. We got over here, man. Yeah, I should be slain before that. You might, you know, because you had different animals and cattle, but you're slain before you eat it, man. Like you said, slain before your ass and you didn't eat it, man. No, they, they was taking it and eating it, man. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. And thy eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, man. They were selling our sons and daughters, man, to different plantations into slavery, man. Like I was saying, for the northern kingdom, man. They started it with y'all, man. They was coming because they was establishing America, man. They would come get y'all. Send them to other different countries. I mean, different states, man. Your children, they'll take the children, man. So, so, like I said, now nah, this was forced upon me. Forced upon me. The Bible seals are deep in this city, says the real boy's here, the white Jesus, man. You know? Now, nah, that was forced upon y'all, man. It, it, like they, they raised a the child up in the way it should go. It, 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 it. When we got home, we were from it, man. That's all they did. They were taking the kids when they was young. And they was teaching what they going to teach you. Because these were you were slaves, they left your child with you. You could teach your child like, okay, you still can teach your child, man. But they took your child and took him to a whole other spot where he by himself, just all the kids. And they taught him what they wanted to teach you, man. And that's what happened, man. Do the, do the research on it. That's what they did to you Latinos, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. Taking your kids by the book, man. And they still got that going on to this day, man. I, th I think it's in North and South Dakota, if I'm not mistaken. They had a Native American so poor. I think the numbers could be wrong, but it's a, it's a half percentage of uh, 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 them go and go to them orphanages, man, because they can't take care of them, man. What you think they doing, man, with them, man? Now they pedophile them, you know, they, 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 you know. But that system was that system started way back, man. That system started way back during the time when the so-called white man came over here and ravaged and ravaged and raped this country, man. It took it from our people, man, but this part of the curses. This part of the curses this that the Lord brought upon us. So thy sons and thy daughters shall be given. Until another people, and their eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, and there shall no be no might in thy hand, man. Let's think about, man. This is slavery, man. This is Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, man. They have an auction, man. And they come take it, and this is what happened, man. They come take your son and your daughter. They separate y'all, man. Sell them to a whole plant, different plantation, man. Be in Mississippi, they sell a plantation in the Georgia, man. This, this, this part of the curses, man. This ain't happening to nobody else, man. But I, but these people on the side, man. You go and look in the history. The so called Jews in the land of Israel, this ain't happening to y'all. Y'all sons and daughters weren't taken and sold to another people. That's how we know y'all ain't the people, man. Y'all, y'all use that whole uh, so called Holocaust thing to try to. Make these curses apply to y'all, man. Nah, man, it was fake anyway. But y'all try to use that, you know, to 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 to, to, to um to basically um uh, try to leap yourself up according to the prophecy of these scriptures. But like y'all it caused your own tongue to stumble up on you, man. Hey, even while it's going over there doing the research, they're like, they're like, well, shit ain't happening, man. You know, she ain't the language. Say with no mighty not here, you couldn't do nothing, man.
come get your son and your daughter and sell them out. All you do is put up a prayer, Lord, Lord, but the sky was raised, and if grand feet of ground up under you was earned, man. It was the time for that, man, so it wasn't nothing, you know, it wasn't, hey, nothing you can do, man, it wasn't nothing we could do. The fruit of thy land and all thy labor shall a nation which thou knowest not eat up, and thou shalt be only oppressed and crushed always. That never stopped, man. That never stopped. Because guess right now, this land belongs to you. So-called Hispanics, Latinos, and Native American Indians, man, North, South, and Central America, man. But you continuously crushed and oppressed, man. So from that time until now, man. You know? <coughs> from the Renaissance period until now, man. Because this your land, man. The South Carolina white man run everything. Even though you got parts of the land left you in, you still control your, 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 your economy and everything, man. Tourist attraction area, the people, the place that make the most money, be controlled by all that, man. Or until you should be continuously oppressed and crushed and continually, man. So that thou shalt be mad for the sight of thine eyes which thou shalt see. Huh? Still happen to this day though, man. So called white man, uh. Still doing that, man. You, 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 you see some bullshit can happen, man. DHS will show up at your house, man. It, 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 it take your fucking kids, man. Come up with a way of law that they can take your kids from you, man. Oh shit, you okay to do, man. The Lord shall smite thee in the knees and in the legs, and with a sore box that cannot be healed from the sole of thy foot to the top of thy head, man. Like you got arthritis, man. Cow. You don't hear the so-called white man going through all the problems, man. Because these are curses that were created for us, man. Everything in this book had to happen, man. The words of the law would not go out void, man. To bring thee and thy king, which thou set over thee, unto a nation which thou neither, which, which neither thou nor thy fathers have known. But there thou shalt serve other gods, wood and stone. Now people serve other gods, man, wood and stone, for other curses. Man. You in the Islam, man, you worship you serving stone, man, that cobble, that cobblestone, man. No? All the Muslims go over there and make their trip to Mecca and walk around that damn, damn stone, man. You know? When they say that sir wood, man. A lot of people like to make different idols and shit, man. The Northern Kingdom, man, got all these idols, man. A lot of people serving money. Money and paper made from wood, man. That should become an astonishment, a proverb, and a bad word among all nations where the Lord should lead. Proverbs and the bad words, man. Negro, West Indian, Haitian, Dominican, Guatemalan, Panamanian, Puerto Rican, Cuban, 
North American Indian, Seminole Indian, Argentinian, Chilean, Colombian, Uruguayan, or Mexican, man. These bad words, man. And then they'll call you a speak, nigga. You know? All that, man. Those are bad words, man. But now it's time for people to come back to your true heritage, man. Which are the Israelites, man. These are these are names on this side, man. For the point. Thou should carry much seed out into the field and should gather but a uh, little in for the locust shall consume it, man. You go to work, you the hardest worker, man. You the you the you the you the hands, feet. Brain, other, 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 all these corporations, man. But you bringing in little, man, why the so-called white man get, get paid, man. I'm finna do a statistic, too, man. For every dollar the so-called white family got, the black family's got six cents, man. Six cents to a dollar, man. Do your research on it, man. Do your research. Another statistic. Every uh, for every black college graduate, man, I want to get this right. He making like thirty thousand a year, man. Yeah, but then you got a white non-college graduate, man. This motherfucker making ninety thousand a year, man. That's the average, man. Do research on it, man. Them numbers might be a little off, but that's estimated, man. For the black families, it's like 30. For the white families, it's between 80 and 90,000, man. But nah, that's not the family, that's college graduate, or uh, so called Negro college graduate, compared to a so called white non college graduate. Thou shalt plant vineyards and dress them, but thou shalt not drink of the wine. Nor gather the grapes, for the worms shall eat them, man. Right, man. Like I said, you're doing all the work. So-called white man, these other nations benefit now for it, man. Even the other nations benefit now for it, man. They come over here and put, 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 put business in your neighborhoods and getting literally getting rich, man. They don't give nothing back. For you other nations, you don't pay too, man. But, did, 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 uh, hey, this got to be real, man. We'll keep going. Thou shalt have olive trees throughout all thy coasts, but thou shalt not anoint thyself with the oil, for thy olive shall cast his, his fruit. Man, we didn't build us everything, man. Everything belonged to us, man. We didn't build everything. Man. Look it up, man. Cell phones, materials. That's just the tech, I'm just going to the main technology they use today. The motors, man, for these cars, man. Those first rotor, um, hey, the rotary motor, man. If I'm not mistaken, they, they, I think them same motors they use in them dog fighters, like some of the first planes, so called white man here, so called black man, oh, it did it then, man. You know, Israelite man, man. Thou shalt beget sons and daughters, but thou shalt not enjoy them, for they should go into captivity, man. Okay, you ain't enjoy your kids, man. They should go into captivity, man. You say you should not enjoy them. Shit, most of the time, you, 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 you get lit times where you can try to enjoy your kids. Because what is what that scripture is the rock? I think it says three things, two things a man like. Uh, See the downfall of his enemy and enjoy his kid and the joy of his kids, man. I'm just basically uh, paraphrasing, man. You know, so you rarely get time to enjoy your kids, man. It's like you wanna enjoy your kids on a day-to-day -day basis, man. These are your kids, man. This is your offspring. This is you. Then say someone should go into captivity, man. That's why a lot of your kids in, in, in jail. You no. Know? 
shit, they have to start working, man. When was slavery, man, they had the babies pick. By the time the baby could walk, you know what I'm They had a cotton, they had a uh, cotton sack on his back and he was picking cotton. Look it up, man. These kids have to work today, man, just to help. Just to help. Dad might be gone. You know, help moms out, man. Just to make it be a less of a burden, man. Our trees and fruit of our land, shall the locusts consume, man. The stranger that is within thee should get above thee very high, and thou should come down very low. There you go. One to all these other nations, man. This how they get above us, man. Because it's the curse we under, man. This how the so-called Arab, Chinese, Japanese come over here to get above you, man. Because it's the curse of the Lord, man. Yeah, they get rich off your dollar, man. They get rich off you, man. And they and it continues to grow. It continues to open up different bids. that show you how much money they they accumulate, man. Well, you can't imagine how much money they look. Ooh, she convenience store accumulate today, man. This the lease of man. They making five thousand dollars a day, man. It's thirty five thousand dollars a week. That's $140,000 a month, man. And that's, that's, that's a low number, man. Tax-free. He should lend to thee, but thou should not lend to him, man. You won't get a car, house. Who got to lend you the money, man? These banks, man. These banks have to approve that, man. Like they lending to you, man. They're on lower level, man. You go into these different, like I said, these different bills of these other people, man. Sometimes you might be broke, you have to borrow something from them, man. I pay you back every first of them, man. I pay you back third, you got a tab with them, man. They ain't borrowing nothing from you, man. As a whole, man. He should be the head and thou should be the tail. Moreover, all these curses should come upon thee. And shall pursue thee and overtake thee. So ain't no getting away, man. Ain't no getting away, man. Ask Bill Cosby. Ask Tiger Woods, man. Now they got Morgan Freeman ass up on the chopping block, man. Ask him, man. Can't get away from the curses, man. Thanking this place, thanking this place, your wrist, man. Watch and see what happens to your ass. Till thou be destroyed, because thou hearken not unto the voice of the Lord thy God to keep his commandments and his statutes which he commanded thee. Hey, excuse me for my language too, man. Spiritual war going on right here, man. No. Keep the aim. It's out, dude. Hey, screw to lock it for the language. It's been defeated somebody. No, it ain't that. I don't got to use that word, but if I do. And that don't mean I ain't telling the truth, man. That don't mean this is not the truth. The same person saying that, you'll push, you push a child out, man. You know? Come on, man. Be real about the situation. His commandments and his statutes which he commanded thee. And they shall be upon thee. All these curses shall be upon us. For a sign and for a wonder and upon thy seed forever, man. So this is how you prove who the Israelites are, man. All these curses gonna pursue us until they overtake us. But they should be for a sign and a wonder upon you and thy seed forever until the Lord deliver us, man. So this how you know who the Israelites are, man. They tell you the Israelites are going 
gonna be in a good position. They don't tell you that until they be delivered and put into their own land. Under our King, man, our Lord and Savior, man, our big brother, man, you have a shot, man, whom the word ignorant called Jesus, man. Thou service not the Lord thy God with joyfulness and with gladness of heart for the abundance of all things, man. So this why, man. It's telling you. Lord should sin against thee. So these ain't our brothers, man. These are our enemies who we serve, man. With an X. You know the so-called white man. This is our wicked brother, man. We're not considered our brother no more. He's our enemy, man. It's our enemy. Say so we're gonna serve our enemy. thirst, and in nakedness, and in want of all things. Got to go from him for everything. If you want to open up a business, you can tell Kyle J, oh, I don't run my own thing. Who you paying taxes to? I got my own house. Who you instead of paying taxes on there? You got to go in to him for him for want of all things. You got to get inspections out of this shit, man. And they constantly take you through this shit. You got a business inspection that pop up in your shit and it, it, it unknown, man. Oh, this wrong, that wrong. Find you. Close you down, man. So they're serving him in the want of all things, and hunger and nakedness and in all things, man. You can't get around it, man. Until the Lord come to live us, man. That's what we're gonna get around this, man. And he should put a yoke of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. He actually done that in slavery, man. For the slaves that were trying to run away, man. Put a yoke of iron on your neck, man. The ones that slaves used to like to run, let them try to run that, man. You're going to earn, catch one of the trees and break your neck, man. So we done that, man. And that yoga man also represents all, represents, represents this hard abundance he got us serving, man. You know? That's that yoga man represents too, man. Oh, white man pull up to this corner. Over this old 70s, all dreamy, man. Probably as much as you got them. Jam, Bun Jovi, and all that. Rock man and shit, man. You know, he's supposed to do this as kingdom, man. But, man, once you see that man, me and other all, bro, he's homeless. Doing his whole day. Doing his whole day. The Lord shall bring a nation against thee from far, from the end of the earth, as swift as the eagle fly, a nation whose tongue thou should not understand, man. And that's what he done, man. That's what he done, man. He done that to the northern and the southern. He started on. Take a left right there. And then take that first right. And it's going to be the first. Done that with the southern kingdom, man. I mean, so, but they, hey, when the so-called white man came over here, he said he was speaking Latin, man. That's why he had Hebrew interpreters, man. Because you didn't understand his language and he didn't understand yours, man. 
So we brought these Hebrew interpreters, man, because that's what you were speaking. Hebrew, man. Broken dialects and Hebrew, you know, different. You know, because our people like to they'll get a language and have different slang words where they don't understand. You know? But they, we didn't understand the language. They don't understand now. Everybody had to a nation of fierce countenance which should not regard the persons of the old nor show favor to the young, man. So the so-called white man ain't show no favor towards the old or the young. For the northern kingdom, man, he killed off your kids, man. That's how he destroyed your mental. You'll be out to hunt, he'll kill a whole village, man. He'll come back, man. Mess your whole man up, man. You don't even want to fight no more, man. What kind of savage and beast is this, man? No mercy on the old water young. He still don't got no mercy on the old water young right now, man. He'll cause the 80 something years old, man. Ready to throw his ass in there. <laughs> Ready to lock his ass up, man. Which that's a big get, man. Making deals with this white man thinking this is his rest, man. But just even going into slavery, they don't care how old or how young you was, man. You're gonna work them fields until you can't work them no more, man. And that still go on today, man. They don't care how old you is, you still in the you, you still working, man. It don't matter to them, man. The raising the um, rate of like retirement, man. Sure they don't care about the old. They don't got no you know, they, they had no pity on the old then, and they still don't got no pity on the old man, man. He should eat the fruit of thy cattle and the fruit of thy land until thou be destroyed, which also shall not leave thee either corn, land, or oil, or the increase of thy kind or flocks of thy sheep until he have destroyed thee, man. Right. Look at, look at the North American, look at the Native American videos, man. As an example, man. Catch out all the reservations. That's just y'all. But I have people too, man. Got us in the ghettos and shit. In the ghettos, man. You know? They call the ghettos, man. In the hood, man. He shall besiege thee in all thy gates. Until thy high and fence walls come down, wherein thou trusted throughout all thy land, and he shall besiege thee in all thy gates throughout all thy land, which the Lord thy power have given thee. He done this in 70 AD. And he done this when he came over here, man. He besieged you, them, he besieged y'all in, in all your lands, man. Because our people now, you best believe, man, everybody on this trial was warriors, man. But the Lord the King's name is very had different fortresses and stuff set up, man. Because they was already fighting amongst each other, man. But all that shit didn't prepare for them when it was time for them to go down, man. They know they prepared when it was time for them to go down, man. Thou shalt eat the fruit of thy own body, the flesh of thy sons and thy daughters, which the Lord thy God have given thee in the seeds and in the straightness wherewith thy enemies shall distress thee. It happened to us in AD, man. In, 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 in a, in a, in a fort that we had called Masada, man. 
locked us in where nothing go in and nothing go out to where our people were forced to eat their own kids. So that the man that is tender among you, very delicate, his eyes should be evil towards his brother, man. So it's the tender and delicate man among you. See, his eyes should be evil towards his brother, man. So that's why this whole time we just can't get along. We ain't get along. We look at you looking at looking at Jake with an evil eye. Like, I can't trust this nigga. I can't trust this arm. This man and Latino and Native American, man. That's the country law put up on us, man. He divided us, man. towards the wife of his bosom, your woman, man. That's why I'm down there, the majority of your relationships fail, man. It's the curse of Lord put up on us, man. Look at the so-called white man, his woman stick on him, too thick or thin, no matter what this nigga do. Fuck up one time, it's over with, man. You so-called mess up one time. Woman, this woman is leaving, man. But this part of the curse the Lord put up on us, man. And these curses that I'm reading about, it's, it's going to always hit the head worse than anybody because it's the head trap. Junior, so-called Negro. should be evil towards the wife of his bosom, man. Towards his brother and the wife of his bosom, man. You know? Look at that, like, I can't trust her. I ain't part of the curse. Going to the curse we read earlier. You betroth the wife and another man should sleep with her, man. And toward the remnant of his children, which he should leave, man. That's a lot of fatherless children in homes, man. It's part of the curse, man. Pop is just up and leave, man. You don't know your daddy, man. You know? It's all part of the curse the Lord put up on us, man. That's why people don't understand what the hell going on, though, man. I'm trying to figure out why, why it's like this and why it's like that, man. Why you never know your pops? It's part of the curse the Lord. It's, the Lord, it's part of the curse the Lord put up on us, man. The plan, man. It's all about getting an understanding why we in the situation we in, man. Some of these fake ass pastors ain't gonna tell you, man. So that he would not give to any of them of the flesh of his children whom he should eat, because he has nothing left in the seed and in the straightness wherewith. Now, an enemy should distress thee in all thy gates, man. Right, man. That seed's still on, man. And that distress can also go into a press. They like the same definitions, man. He's distressing, he's pre he pressing on you, man. Both have what y'all need. You don't gotta look at him like shit. He might try. You ain't looking at him with no evil eye, man. But it's all part of that willy lips. It's all orchestrated by the so called white man. Ultimately, the Lord used it. wonderful and the plagues of thy seed even great plagues and of long continuance 
and sore sickness and of long continuance, man. So this is what it is, man. Moreover, he will bring upon thee all the diseases of Egypt, which thou wast afraid of, and they shall cleave unto thee. Also, every sickness and every plague, which is not written in the book of, of this law, them until the Lord bring upon thee until he destroy thee. And ye shall be left fewer in number, whereas you was as the stars of heaven for a multitude, because thou wouldest not obey the voice of the Lord thy power. So-called Taino Indians, man. They were eight million strong. When, 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 when uh, Columbus made it over here, man. When, when he got through with them, they were 500. They, were, they, were, they, was, they was cut down to 500, man. For the so-called Mexican population, man. The whole Aztec Empire y'all had going on, man. He took out a third of y'all population with smallpox, man. That so-called Inca Empire, man. When you go to the tribe of Asher, man. The Inca Empire, and they, 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 they was feeding everybody from, uh, basically from Colombia to the Uruguay, man. It was, a, it was an empire that extended, I think, from 2,000 to 3,000 miles long, man. The Inca Empire was so powerful, the Inca Empire was feeding everybody, man. Get y'all that smallpox, too, man. I forgot how much of the population they took out, man. They got uh, uh, so called Negroes, man. Just, just throw you overboard, man, before you made over here 100 years, man. I was put down to a small point. But the Lord has revived us, man. Because we weren't sold to the nation for our destruction. But because we moved the Lord's crap. Nope. That's just a few examples of a couple of the tribes, man. We don't know everything the so called white men did, man. But just like the scripture said, earth don't, uh, don't disclose her blood, man. That's what you see right there, man. Yeah, the devil's punch bowl in Natchez, man. Natchez, Mississippi. Which the Union soldiers killed those uh, so-called free slaves. And there, you should be left free in number, whereas you was as the stars of heaven for multitude, because thou wouldest not obey the voice of the Lord thy God. And this shall come to pass, that as the Lord rejoiced over thee to you to do good and to multiply you, so the Lord will rejoice over you to destroy you. And bring, and to bring, and to bring you to naught. shall scatter thee among all people from the one end of the earth even unto the other. And there thou shalt serve other gods which neither thy fathers have known even wood and stone. 
And amongst these nations, thou shalt find no ease. Neither shall the sole of thy foot have rest. 